Children's Story. Kids Magical Treehouse Takes Flight. Secret Valley and Sparkling Laughter. Keyword Rich. Emphasizes the fantastical element. Once upon a time, in a sun-dappled glade, lived a little boy named Pip. Pip wasn't interested in ordinary things. He didn't care for shiny gadgets or fancy toys. Pip's heart soared with the birds, whispered with the leaves, and dreamed in dandelion fluff. His playground wasn't a swing set or a sandbox, but a magnificent treehouse nestled high in the branches of a giant oak. This wasn't your average treehouse. Oh no. It was a kaleidoscope of dreams adorned with pine cones like tiny treasure chests, windows that winked like fireflies, and a roof woven from sunlight and spider silk. It was a pirate ship sailing through emerald seas of leaves, a cozy dragon's nest tucked amongst the stars, and a secret kingdom hidden from prying eyes, all in one. One magical morning, as Pip climbed the moss-covered ladder, a playful breeze tickled his nose. He swore he heard a whisper, like leaves dancing in the wind. Come along, little dreamer, it chirped. He looked up, eyes wide, as the branches began to sway, not in the wind, but with purpose. Before Pip could blink, the treehouse lurched, branches creaking in harmony. Up, up, they rose, leaving the forest floor behind like a patchwork quilt. The world shrunk below, houses turning into dollhouses, and the forest becoming a vibrant tapestry of greens and golds. Pip, who loved surprises more than anything, giggled with delight as they skimmed past fluffy white clouds that looked like cotton candy, sheep and dodged playful bolts of rainbow-colored lightning. The sun turned their laughter into golden confetti, and the wind sang a song of freedom in his ears. The journey led him to a hidden valley nestled beneath mountains that kissed the clouds. Here, waterfalls sang crystal clear melodies, flowers bloomed in impossible colors, and creatures with fur as soft as dandelion fluff frolicked in meadows dotted with butterflies, the size of kites. One, a fluffy creature with ears that twitched like antennae, introduced itself as Luna, the guardian of laughter. She explained that a grumpy shadow creature, jealous of everyone's joy, had stolen the valley's laughter, leaving behind only silence and glumness. Determined to help, Pip teamed up with Luna and the cheerful valley creatures. They braved rivers of shimmering jelly, outsmarted mischievous squirrels who hoarded giggles, and learned to speak the language of wind chimes, which, they discovered, were actually tiny laughter factories. Through laughter-filled challenges and silly songs sung under sparkling waterfalls, Pip and his newfound friends gathered stolen giggles and tickles, rebuilding the valley's laughter bit by bit. Finally, in a showdown that crackled with dandelion fluffs of pure joy, Pip tricked the shadow creature into laughing so hard it burst, harmlessly, of course, into a million shimmering giggles. The valley was awash with laughter, a melody sweeter than honey, a symphony more joyful than a thousand sunrises. Luna's gratitude was as bright as the valley blossoms, and Pip received the greatest gift of all, a heart overflowing with the pure magic of laughter. As the treehouse gently descended back to its familiar oak, Pip knew it wasn't just a magical house but a vessel of joy, a reminder that laughter is the greatest adventure of all, and whenever he heard the wind rustle through the leaves, he knew it was singing the secret song of the valley, a song that would forever echo in his heart. So, the next time you see a treehouse nestled in the branches, remember the story of Pip and his flying laughter castle. It's a reminder that even the most ordinary things can hold extraordinary magic, and that the greatest adventures often begin begin with a single, joyful giggle.